Hello lords and ladies of Westeros. Welcome to Siege of Winterfell Round 4. Now this time it will be a match between SKM Moonstark of K68 against S1N Sunlight 1 of K93. SKM with a big advantage in terms of numbers of players joining the event and 1B higher in total rating. SKM will be on Greyjoy's side and S1N on Stark's side. Necessary gears and buffs have already been applied. Battle will begin in 5 seconds, so get ready guys. Alright, both teams is on the run to occupy both Starks and Radio Outposts. And I'll be heading to Neutral Outpost, Greyjoy right side. Maps showing both outposts were successfully occupied. A lot of SKM troops being deployed in Hot Spring. And on the other hand, S1N wanted to dominate the armory as lots of its troops are being deployed there. At 56.51 of the game, both teams are pretty much equal in points and captured buildings. After capturing both outposts in Greyjoy's side, SKM begins to advance some of its troops to Winterfell. Two minutes before the armory opens up, both teams begin to fight for it. While one of S1N troops begins to test the strength of SKM troops stationed at Winterfell 6 minutes too early before Winterfell opens up. And decided to run away. Or he could be setting up a trap. Going back to the armory, battle goes on and pretty much equal at this point. But seems like more S1N troops are being deployed there to reinforce. S1N winning the armory. Meanwhile, SKM captured Hot Spring and a little skirmish is going on in there. SKM begins to attack some of S1N troops coming near Winterfell. Eight seconds before Winterfell gives out its first chest. SKM obtaining it and being escorted by yours truly to make sure it's safe on its way to the outpost. At 45 minutes of the game, SKM advances its troop to attack S1N captured neutral outpost.
first chest successfully delivered by SKM in their outpost, making the score 14,320 against 9,140 with six captured building against four of S1N at 44 minutes of the game. Meanwhile, fight for the armory is still on. and SKM winning the battle. There's some resistance from S1N. But he's been eliminated by SKM troops and SKM winning the armory. Meanwhile, few seconds left before the next chest to be available. Second chest obtained again by SKM. One on one skirmish between SKM Haste and S1N, Lord Syrinx. S1N eliminated and SKM winning back the outpost. Battle in Winterfell goes on again as S1N troops attempts to recapture it. More from S1N is coming to help. SKM successfully defended Winterfell with yours truly. An attempt by SKM to recapture S1N outposts is being met by few S1N troops. SKM winning it. Which makes SKM captured building 7-3 against S1Ns. Halfway through this game, score is 30,020 SKM against 14,540 S1N. Time remaining, 31.50. SKM troops continue to advance and captured another building, which leaves S1N with only one.
third chest was obtained by SKM again. Taking this chest to their outpost will secure a better chance of win for SKM as game clock passed halfway through the time limit. Meanwhile, more of S1N troops are being dispatched to Winterfell. but are easily eliminated by SKM troops as they are still outnumbered. Some SKM are backing up, but I will continue to advance in some of my teams as well. This will not be good for S1N as they are attacking individually. Meanwhile, there's an attempt by S1N troops to recapture left side Stark neutral outpost. So we have to take our troops there to prevent it. I'm gonna maneuver to make an attack from the back of the enemy. But the enemy is trying to evade my attack and decided to go on circle. Now is the good time to attack. He is pretty strong though. My troops are all in red line. He's got my third group. And my second one. Now I'm down to only one group fighting him. But more of my allies is coming to help. And we completely get them all eliminated. 
Meanwhile, SKM secured the next chest with only 18 minutes left time remaining. This will surely seal the deal for SKM. SKM continued to advance to capture all the buildings including Stark Outpost. And now, SKM is on the S1N base to give more pressure. This will truly hurt them a lot. And with this overwhelming lead in score, there's only little to no hope for S1N to win with only this little time remaining. SKM are all over their base. S1N at this point can't do anything to prevent us from coming all the way here. SKM captured all the buildings leaving S1N with nothing. This must have been very frustrating on their part. Because actually they are doing well on the early stage of the game but crumbles to the ground at the end. There are still some resistance can be seen on different parts of the map, but it's a sure win for SKM at this point. As my team says, they are both angry and hungry. All chess has been obtained and delivered by SKM, and this has been a no contest for SKM.
And that'll be it. SKM winning overwhelmingly against S1N with a total score of 87,220 against only 20,220 of S1N. Haste being the best player for SKM. Congratulations. And so there you have it. How about you guys? Would you like to share your Siege of Winterfell experience? Do you have some ideas that you would like to share to improve the game? I would really love to hear your opinions or suggestions. Just let me know on the comment section below. And if you like this video, just mash the like button to motivate me to do more fun, exciting, and informative videos. And hit that subscribe button to keep you updated with my latest content here on YouTube. I hope you've all enjoyed and learned something from watching this video and that'll be all for now. I'll see you all on my next one and may the 7th be with you.